Hi guys, uh, it's Aegis here, and uh, we finally uh, get the chance to crack this Shadow Piloting Trial deck. Uh, so, I'm actually quite excited to try the new Blaster Dark in my uh, premium MLB because uh, his skill is quite interesting now and uh, compared to the old Blaster Dark that only got the skill when he's in Vanguard now he got a Riga skill so he's more useful in the deck so let's crack it Blaster Dark, so he got a first skill, Vanguard and Riga skill when he appears. By counting the blasting one, your opponent needs to choose a uh, Regard and Retired. Um, so instead of counting the blasting two to kill anything you want, now you make your opponent to kill one of the unit. But uh, if they got uh, a skill like they, the unit cannot be retired, and your opponent choose that then well bad luck so make sure you check your opponent's view before you decide to use, use this skill and the second skill is an active skill uh, if once per turn if your opponent do not have any regards by discarding one card in from your hand uh, during the turn this unit will get uh, one more drive so will become a train drive so uh, is quite interesting by uh, getting more drives and shadow paladins from uh, trying to stay like more defensive, uh, gaining advantage and then slowly winning games. And of course, sometimes you can do like in lower you can do like quick combos and win. But the very very old shadow paladin when they first out, uh, they're more defensive. They are uh, like Royal Paladins, they can call people, they can uh, discard and then draw, they can call units for free, uh, they got retired, and the defense is usually higher, so they are like long lasting clan in battle. But now, uh, it seems a little bit changing because they are more focusing on uh, like killing opponent's units and then depending on if you have enough stuff on the field so I think it's slightly different but we will need to try it out uh, I, of course we will be cracking uh, the new booster but I'm not sure if I will uh, get some spare cash for Shadow Paladin if uh, Dark Reaculous is cheap enough then I might just get a little bit and try it out because I have so many force clans right now, so I uh, don't plan to keep uh, getting more, but we'll see. And then we have our star, uh, the Dark Dictator. Uh, I think his skill is reviewed quite a while ago, but more clear pictures within this week. So, uh, first, his skill is uh, a Vanguard skill. Which during your turn for each regard you have, this unit will get 2k power. So this skill is just like the old favorite old Alfred, but uh, he can be boosted. And then uh, the second skill is active skill by counter blasting one. Uh, call up to one grade two unit from your hand. During the turn, that unit will get 5k plus, and your opponent will need to uh, retire one of the regards. So. Compared to his old version, he is now a very strong unit and not only that he uh, do what the old elf is supposed to do, but he also get a retire skill. So 
it's more like the new Shadow Paladins is more focusing on retiring opponents, opponent stuff while trying to uh, call more comrades on the field. So we get four here. And then we get this uh, common guy, uh, not the falling guy with attacking Vanguard. If uh, your regard is more than your opponent's regard, then he will get 5k power. So, very simple stuff. Not very strong, but usable. Uh, and then this card, uh, when your other regards appears during the turn, you can make this unit to plus 5k, which makes me feel a little bit weird because it's like a, you can choose to do it or not. But like, if you're playing her, you won't try to give up the 5k, I think. And then, uh, Old friend, Blaster X, 10k vanilla, nothing to say. And we have a different art, uh, Blaster Dark here. So, two different arts, depending on which one you like. Uh, well, I kind of like both, but uh, it seems... Uh, this one look a little bit more fierce so if you ask me which one I like I might actually like this one a little bit, a little bit more just a little and then uh, you have doggy uh, when boost when this card boosts and the attack is the vanguard counter blasting one during the turn select other two units plus 5k so a little bit pressuring unit and then uh, our very very old friend Blaster Javelin uh, when he appears as a, as a regard uh, if there's another of your great one regard by counter blasting one draw one and uh, this unit will get, will get 3k so it's kind of a one off but not bad and then we have a PG, so depending on if you want to use the draw trigger, then you have a choice. And get back to her. Uh, so last thing, one rest this unit. You return uh, one of the unit get plus ten k, but I don't think I will use her because. Uh, not that effective compared to other not pressuring and using soul so not too sure if I want to use her for now I will say no and then the full ball uh, crits and crits and draws and heals and then uh, force markers so it seems I don't have any trigger points or like the special thing to get a sign card, something like that. But that's fine. If the time comes, you will see it. If not, that, that means I'm still waiting. So, uh, yeah, that basically is how this TD is structured. So. I'll make it short here, not making it too long, and do stay tuned for my uh, unboxing, which should come in a bit of time, as usual. And do comment below if you want to see a uh, premium MLB build. It won't be like a full uh, perfect G zone because I don't have uh, Ultima. Uh, I don't have face like Outmaw and all the brave side stuff just because I want to keep it like more blaster focus and more fun play but if you want to see it comment below let me know then I'll see if a lot of people want to see it then depending on that then I might make it 
so let me know and before the next video i will see you guys next time signing off